how to screen record on MacBook. Today I'm going to show you how to screen record on MacBook. Currently I have the display which I want to be recording, the screen that I want to record. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find the QuickTime app. So what I'm going to do is go down to the menu bar and it is not currently on this bar down here so I'll have to go into Launchpad. So I clicked onto Launchpad and where my QuickTime app is located is in the other and it may be located there for yours as well. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that and then I'm going to scroll through all of these until I find the QuickTime player app right here. You see this? The QuickTime player app. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And when I click on that, it brings me up to this screen with previous uh, screen recordings that I have. So what I'm going to do is, while I'm on this uh, screen right here, this pop-up right here, I'm just going to go ahead and go down to Cancel. And after I press Cancel, you'll look at the top right here. It is QuickTime up there. So it says QuickTime up here, and it has all of these features right here going on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to File, click on File, and then I'm going to go down to New Screen Recording, okay? Really important, go to New Screen Reporting. And when I tap on that, it brings up this pop-up right here. Now, this pop-up right here is the screen recording. It's what's going to be recorded when I start. Now, it's important to know that you can adjust how much of the screen gets recorded. So I can actually... I'm going to be recording inside of this window right here, so I'm going to actually make it a little bit smaller because I don't want to record other things uh, on the full display screen. So I'm going to just crop it to what I want to record. And then once I have it cropped, I know that this is the area which is going to be screen recorded. So what I'm going to do is, after this, I can go ahead and get started by pressing record. Or I can go to options right here, where it has options of uh, different things that I can do while recording or before recording. So I can tap on that. And it brings me up to this screen right here. And there's a lot of options. Now, there's a timer right here, so I can record... Um, uh, when I press record, it will count down five seconds before it starts recording. And then right here, it counts down 10 seconds if I wanted to choose that option. Now, if I don't want any countdown, I can go to none. But let me go ahead and put it back to five seconds. There's also some options down here that you can choose from. It says the microphone. You can actually uh, choose what type of microphone that you want to be using while you record. You can use the MacBook Pro microphone if you so choose, or if you have an input microphone, you can select that if it pops up here. And if you don't want to record, you can go ahead and select none right here. Now there are some additional options down here, but I won't go through those. I'll just go through the most important ones. So once I have that, I click out of that, and at the bottom right here, it's it shows record. This is the record button. And so when I press this, it will start to record everything that's in this highlight box right here. So I'm going to go ahead and press record. And it's giving me a countdown of 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. So now it's recording. And an indicator to know that it's recording is this uh, icon right up here. This is the recording icon. It lets me know that recording is going on. As well as if I'm ready to stop, I just go ahead and click on this icon again. All right. Or I can press escape. All right. So I'm looking at this page right here and it's currently recording. So I'm just going to go ahead and scroll up like this. So I'm scrolling up and it's recording right here. Everything that is inside of this box right here. I was talking about the Apple Watch, the 7 Series, all of this right here. Everything that's that's going on, it's recording right there. All right, so I'm just going to uh, turn the sound off for a second on this right here, just for this demonstration purposes. And when I'm done recording or capturing the footage that I want to record, I'll go right here. 
and I'll go ahead and press stop. All right, so I pressed stop right here. And here is my recording right here. So this is the recording everything that was recorded just in that small area. So I'm going to move my mouse out of the way. I didn't start moving anything around at, until after a few seconds. It recorded everything that was in that highlight box. Now, this is just for previewing right here. And so I can go ahead and press pause if I want to. Now to save this, to save this, sometimes I do it the lazy way, just press X right here and it will prompt me with the a location where I want to save it. But I'm just gonna go ahead and press file and actually I can go to export as if I'd like right here and it says export and it gives me options of what I can export this as. I can export it as a 4K video, a 1080p, a 720p, a 480p, or I have the option to do audio only. Now, with this right here, I'm going to go with 4K and I pushed that and selected that. Now, I have uh, my options right here of where I can save it. I can name it screen recording 2022 right here but i can go ahead name it screen recording for the people so i'll go ahead and type in what i want and after i've typed it in i'm able to save it where i'd like to save it okay so you can go ahead and make the selection currently it's going to be saving in this area right here all right, so you can change where you want this to be saved. I'm just going to go ahead desktop and screen recordings. I'm going to save it in that folder right there, which is actually this folder right here. And so once I've done that, I'm just going to go ahead and press save. And it saved the video and I can go ahead and open it up to take a look at it. It's saved right in here. All right, so that's how you do a screen recording on a MacBook. I hope this was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.